Hey everybody, I went shopping this morning. Um, I saw Jen Evers' video on her process video for her It Girls and said, I need to get myself one of those water brushes. And so I decided to go take a look and see if I could find them. And I first went to Joann's and they didn't have them. Uh, but of course, I looked around and I found some other things that I had to have. I first realized, remembered that my paper trimmer uh, blades were dull. So I picked up um, replacement blades for my Fiskars paper trimmer. And these were on sale 40% off, and they were $4.19. And then I was um, looking around at other things and saw these paper stacks uh, on Special Buy. This one um, is adorable. I kind of leafed through all the paper stacks they had there, and it was between this one or one called, I think it's called Citrus Lane, I think, and um, I decided on this one because it has some glitter pages and uh, brighter colors. Um, I don't know if everybody has seen this stack or not, but it's just really cute. And I do have a project um, that I'm going to try to do. It is for Sammy Stamps, and she's having a challenge for using one of her stamps. And I, I recently won Archana's uh, Show Me Your Dies, and the um, prize was to pick... Oh, you get a gift, a $12 gift card for Sammy Stamps. And I went over there and I looked and I picked up three of her stamps, digital stamps. And, um, yeah, and the challenge is to use one of her stamps and to add stripes. And so I was looking for um, some paper that had some really cute striping. And, you know, this one has a couple of potential ones. This is the one I might use. Um, but we'll see. I've already actually colored her digital stamp. Oh, and this one's embossed. So I can get that to show up. I don't think it's gonna, maybe. Um, these dots are embossed too. But anyways, um, but yeah, this is really cool. I actually only paid two dollars for this, uh, this paper stack because I used their uh, Firefly Frenzy 50% off um, coupon for today. And then there's this one that starts tomorrow and Saturday. I don't think I'll be going back, but anyways. Um, so yeah, I got this paper stack, these this paper trimmer blades, and I also found some remnants. And I... I was turned on by this color because of Jen Evers and her orange challenge. I saw this. Actually, I first saw this one. I'm like, ooh, pretty. And then, I, of course, the stripes challenge that Sammy's having. But anyway, so I saw this, and then I saw this. And the remnants are normally 50% off of the price that's on here. Like, that price. Um, but I was looking, and it said 50% off, and I didn't think anything of it. It's like, they're normally 50% off anyways. Um, but I looked at my receipt, and I think I, if I'm reading my receipt right, this, uh, remnant right here, I only paid 47 cents for. Um, and then this one, I paid 93 cents for. So that was a pretty good deal for those, and I don't know, I... Kind of thinking I might make a little pillow, maybe. Just need to be able to dig out my sewing machine and get it to work right. It's got some problems. But, um, I also went 
through their dollar to five dollar aisle and I saw this book and it's adorable. Um, the eyes turn to express different emotions and then I saw this one with the bear one that does the same thing. Um, but I actually bought three of this one because that's what I found on the shelf and the one mouse and the bear is going to go into my book stash for my granddaughter and then these two I'm going to put into my art stash this one one of them will probably go into my giveaway challenge for somebody to take and maybe alter or use for whatever um, it'll probably be put in the box for that but uh, yeah so I got those and I also found this stamp it was a dollar and these books were a dollar um, I think I'm going to use this stamp on Sammy's stripe challenge and then I found this button up near the register. They have some clearance buckets up near the register. And I thought this was really cute. So, and they didn't have any more of these. I would have picked up a couple more of these. But that's what I spent at Joann's. And then I went over to Hobby Lobby. And I'm so excited to be able to say that. Um, to see if they had the water brush. Okay, so, um... I didn't go straight back to the water brushes because the first time I went into Hobby Lobby, I, I didn't go to the left. I just kind of went straight into the right to look at the stuff there. But this time I went to the left, which I knew where the yarn, that's where the yarn was. And oh my goodness. I'm, it, anybody that has a Hobby Lobby knows and does yarn, their selection is amazing. Um... But I did find on my way over to the yarn, I went past laces and trims, and I found this spool. I don't know where the end of it is. Let's see. Where's the end? I don't know. Ah, uh, there it is. Okay, so it's these uh, pearl dangles trim. Um, these are the heart ones that are white. And uh, and I know um, alcohol markers color these up pretty good. And so I picked up a spool of the white, and they're only $1.99. That's impressive. I love that. And I, they had the teardrops, but they only had ivory in um, stock, and I wanted white. The lady that was there, she was super helpful and answering questions, and, and had a chat with the lady in the yarn, too. But the... Uh, she says, I talked to him about ordering and stuff, and she says, um, if there's something that's gone on the shelf, the next time they order stuff, it's probably going to be there, so I can go back in and see, or call them. She wrote all this down for me. Call them if they got it in, if they have any, and yada yada. So, I have that to get some teardrop pearls, pearl trim. And then I picked up these uh, freebies in the yarn area. This bag is really cool. And I picked up this one. Um, the pattern for this is in this. And it's for the dress, the hat, and the blanket. And then this afghan looks pretty amazing. This uh, doesn't have the pattern on it. I guess you have to go to their website to see 
the yarn it used and stuff like that. And then there was these um, pillows, that pillow, and then this um, crocheted cowl. So yeah, those are fun to find. But I also found these. They're small, uh, really small, small bottles. It might be difficult to fill, but um, I don't know. Is this the same same sort of thing you were using, Jen, for your little thin line bottles? So yeah, I got those. I found this um, $7.99 usually but I had a 40% off coupon so I used the coupon for that and uh, came out to $4.79 for this water brush and that's my haul today from Joann's and Hobby Lobby I also want to share with you some pictures that I colored First, these are digital images. Uh, digital images from Jan Ever, Evers, sorry. And, uh, I used Sharpies on these. I really like the owl, how that came out. And then a little chick. And then on this one, I used my alcohol. Uh, shoot chromatics that's what they're called and maybe it's the paper I don't know blending doesn't work at least in my opinion the, the line on it is just too sharp and I I did it fast I did this and then I added the other color and it just doesn't blend so yeah and then I used some a glitter pen on the eye here that shows up or not. So there's those. And then I took some digital images that uh, Jamie has done and my first one was this one. This one was done with color pencils without watercolor pencils without water. Um, I liked how they came out without getting them wet. So, that one, and then her new one, Picky Princess, this is the coloring on that one. Um, tried to do some shading on the hair, it's not great, but it's okay. And then I added the glitter pencil, or the glitter pen, um, to her crown. And I had to give her purple eyes, just because... I love purple and a green dress. Um, I don't have any plans for these yet, but I felt like coloring yesterday, so that's what I did. I colored and watched videos. <laughs> um, so that's it. That's all I've got to share. Oh, and I am so tickled about my name plaques that I've gotten so far. I I feel honored and blessed to, to have these beautiful plaques to switch out and look at and have in my videos. Um, so thanks everybody for watching and I hope you all are having a great day and uh, I'll talk to you guys another time. Alright, bye bye.